We are stepping into the test kitchen with Chef Cohen. Dude, how are you doing, buddy? Yeah, well, the recipe cool. kitchen. The recipe kitchen, it's sorry. New, it's the new, recipe I understand, kitchen. but yes, it's the recipe kitchen. Yes, okay, cool. So this is quite fun today because we're cooking with lemons, okay? And this is such a great ingredient, but you know, you're gonna show us a simple way of making lemon cheesecake, one of my ultimate favorites. Super simple, and we're giving a sweet t uh, spin to a nice uh, tart lemon dish, so Sounds let's do this. fantastic, okay. Take it away, Chef Cohen. So we're gonna need jelly. Okay. Um, cottage cheese. Condensed milk, yogurt, yes. lemon juice, and some uh, vanilla. Some vanilla essence. Vanilla. Got it. We're gonna start off by taking our jelly, and we're just gonna pour our tartar jelly into hot water. Do we need to stir it? Would you be so kind? I would. Thank you. That's it. I'm just gonna dissolve that. And this Got is how it. simple the recipe is. We are gonna then take our cream cheese. Okay. This way it gets technical. Cream That's cheese, it. condensed milk. Perfect. Oh, yes. look at all that Harvey sweetness. That's gonna be our so how was your Valentine's Day? It was Valentine's Day. There was <laughs> romance and redness and... <laughs> yes. so good. I, I feel like we accomplished the day, you know. Oh, good, good, I, good. I, I cooked, which is... Of course you did. So, <laughs> it's like every other day, really speaking. <laughs> <laughs> okay, cool. So we've got our jelly all mixed up. Thank you. And then we've got the rest of our ingredients going in. So we've got our milk, our condensed milk, our... Uh, vanilla essence. And, uh, vanilla extract. It's express they give us extract. They give us the good stuff, yes. The ah, extract. So that's the real deal. That's the real, real deal. So nice. I'm gonna put that aside. I'm gonna grab our delightful, fantastic Philips hand blender. <laughs> and Love I'm it. Gonna, ooh. But you know what? For, for if you want to make your uh, own lemon cheesecake, just like Chef Cohen is doing, it's not the keyword recipe kitchen uh, to three three seven two eight. That's the keyword recipe kitchen to three three seven two eight. And you also stand the chance to win this fantastic uh, Daily Oliver hand blender, courtesy of Philips. Okay. I was wondering how we were going to work that one out. That's fine, I'll just shout it. Keep going. Okay. Uh, what well, I'll tell you what, you finish up there. So what we've got here is we've got our blended mix, okay? Okay, is that it? Is that enough? That, that, that's enough, it's just to incorporate everything. Brilliant. Let's we're then going to add in here. our setting agent, which is our flavouring agent as well, which is our jelly. Yes. We're using the lemon today, but I actually have used pineapple before. Okay. And then thrown in some drained pineapple pieces. Nice. So we're going to add gonna that give in. a bit of texture there. A little bit of texture, it's going to be our setting yeah. agent. And that's all quite a firm mix, it's not firm, but it's quite a heavy mix at the moment. Yes. So to incorporate some lightness into the dish, Great. we're going to add in some whipped cream. So we're going to add it in two, in two um, trenches. The first one is going to be just a little bit, and this is called slacking. So basically... Slacking? Slacking. It's just Never heard that before. We're just going to loosen up, make the whole mixture nice and slack. It's going to be nice and thin. All right. And now that it's slightly smoother, it's easier to fold in the rest of the cream now because it's not as... The viscosity has changed. Exactly, exactly. Oh, what a great way to start off a Monday morning in the kitchen with our lemon cheesecake this morning. We are cooking with lemons. SMS the keywords recipe kitchen. That's recipe kitchen to 33728. We'll send you the shopping list and a link to the recipe. And you can also stand the chance of winning this fantastic Jamie Oliver hand blender courtesy of Philips this morning. Very, very nice. All right. And it works quite a job. And then that's just going to go into our... What do you have at the base there? Now, this is a, a good old-fashioned uh, biscuit base. So, okay. up crushed biscuits with some melted butter. Nice. And then for a little extra oomph, uh, we've, thrown, <laughs> <laughs> we've thrown in some ground cinnamon. Just All right. to give it a little bit of legs. Nice. And then this whole mixture... Oh, look how good and light and, and fluffy that is. And that's pretty much it, is. eh? That, that, it's, it's, I would never complicate your lives. I'm kind of... So, obviously, that. at this stage, it doesn't look very cheesecakey. No, but that's a, it's a little bit of time in the fridge. That's it. Let it uh, ponder its <laughs> itself, reflect on the day it's had so far, set up, that's it. and then yeah, and then it's going to be very cheesecakey. Okay, let me you can have the bowl. Oh, thank you so much. All and right, now going to the fridge to set. All right, just and like that. Just like that. And then how long do you leave it for? Um, I'd say about a good three hours or so. Is it? I have before when I've been in a rush chucked it into a freezer. Ooh, can you do that? You can do it, but then you got to keep an eye on it because the minute okay. it freezes, then it's gone too far. So okay. keep an eye on it. It drops temperature really right. quickly. So is there any way of telling that it's ready? Because I know from you know experience, you can bake cheesecake, you put it in the oven for a certain amount yeah. of time, and it's good. But if you leave it in the in the fridge, well, basically it's on a firm texture like this. So if okay. you touch it the back of your finger. That's it. Yeah, you yeah. know, just like that. Just like that. It's and I made a. Delicious. <laughs> that is amazing. Yes. Wow. So SMS is the keywords recipe kitchen. That's recipe kitchen to 33728. We'll send you the shopping list and a link to the recipe and you can stand the chance of winning this Jamie Oliver um, hand blender courtesy of Philips. Very, very cool. Ja uh, Jamie, I almost called you Jamie. I Cohen. should be so lucky. You should be so lucky. <laughs> and you're just decorating that with? Some uh, candied lemon peel. So candied just boil peel. some water and sugar together. 
throw in the lemon peel, pull it out um, after about five minutes or so, let it yes. cool, and candied lemon peel. Okay. I, when life gives you lemons, make love cheesecake as far as I'm concerned. So I'll tell you what, while you dish me up a lovely little slice of a lemon cheesecake, stay tuned because we have lots more lemon recipes coming your way on this morning's Feel Good Breakfast Show. It's time for a quick ad break. We'll see you after these. Add a touch of festive sweetness with Heinz Custard and Trotter's Jelly.